welcome to your latest edition of Warwickshire Weekly News. In the news this week, the return of the Dementia Friends Challenge has taken place across the county as part of Dementia Awareness Week 2017, which ran from May the 14th to 21st. The campaign aims to support the more than 7,000 people that are currently living with dementia across Warwickshire, with this figure forecast to rise to more than 11,000 over the next 10 years. Dementia Friends is a national initiative led by the Alzheimer's Society and Warwickshire County Council is urging as many people as possible to sign up. You can find out more information by visiting dementiafriends.org.uk as well as at warwickshire.gov.uk forward slash dementia. And in other news, the Smart Start funded Food for Life programme is helping to educate parents and children about healthy eating. The scheme is working alongside 10 local nurseries and three children's centres and offers guidance on how they can provide good food and make healthy, tasty, sustainable meals. It's being offered in conjunction with Smart Start's ongoing community project Little Green Fingers, which trains staff to educate parents about the benefits of fruit and vegetables. And finally this week, with anticipation building ahead of the OVO Energy Women's Tour that will be coming to Warwickshire on June the 9th, County Council staff and their children have taken part in the Static Bike Challenge. The event was held by local charity cyclists Fighting Cancer and saw 23 teams entering the challenge to see who could cycle the furthest. The riders achieved a combined distance of just over 366 kilometres, nearly 2.5 times the distance of the Warwickshire State of the coming women's tour. All of the donated bikes will now be sold in the charity shop in Alderminster with the proceeds helping to support its life-changing work. And that's all for another week. Please come back soon for more updates from around the county. We hope to see you then.